Hi there, wig lover. This is Heather from SisterWigs.com, and today I'm bringing you a review of a John Renault Remy human hair wig called Sienna. And the color is one of their chocolate collection colors for human hair, which is FS6 slash 30 slash 27, also known as Toffee Truffle. So before I do anything else, I'd like to talk about the color just a little bit. I don't know if you own any of the Toffee Truffles in the synthetic or the heat-friendly synthetic versions of this color, but if you do, you'll know right away that this is more red and lighter than either the synthetic or heat-friendly synthetic versions of this color. Part of that is because human hair, once it's lightened so you can put color into it, pulls to reds like gangbusters. So reds in most human hair colors, um, because you know they're using the same kind of dyes that they use on the synthetic, they pull to that red even more intensely. So that light caramel brown takes on a much more light auburn hue, and the 30 really pops. It really looks like a light copper color and it's a little more intense than what you would see in the synthetic version of the color. By comparison, you can see the same effect happens on this. This is uh, Carrie in Midnight Cocoa, which is a slightly darker chocolate uh, collection color. And you can see that in both colors, there are more red than their synthetic counterparts. There's a lot of red going on in both of these colors. This has a number 27, which is a light auburn, and a number 30, which is a medium auburn in the highlights. And they sort of blend together in the human hair a little bit better than what you'd see in the synthetic. So it's a very dynamic color. It looks a little less streaky in the human hair um, than it does in the synthetic, as you can probably tell. So it's very pretty, super dynamic looking. Definitely looks chocolatey. So, Let's talk about the cap on Sienna since it's off my head. This is a smart lace front, monofilament top wig. Both of those features are hand tied. Then we have open wefts on the side, open wefts on the back. It has an extended felt nape with Velcro adjusters in the back. Generous amounts of elastic on the sides. And it also has felt here on the ear tabs. And before I put Sienna on, I'd like to comb the top a little bit so I can show you what the monofilament looks like. Mm -hmm. So this is not a rooted color. And you can see this is a really thick mono top. I sort of have to hold the hair down a little bit so you can actually see those knots. Very thick on top of Sienna here. Now, just like all human hair wigs, Remy or otherwise, you'll want to wash and style this wig before you wear it. It's not going to be ready to wear right out of the box. Just part of the reason why I didn't start the video with it on. I'm going to go ahead and put Sienna on for you now. Making sure those ear tabs are flush up against the side of my head. I love the length of this wig. Like, I really love Sienna. I think this is a really cute wig. So let's talk some specs. The bang on Sienna is 9 inches. The crown down is 14.5. The sides are 13. So they're, they're pretty long, pretty uniform. And then the nape is 10.75. So she's pretty long in the back. So let me go ahead and show you what Sienna looks like right out of the box. I've only been playing with her on camera. So this is the first time I've put her on, haven't styled, washed anything. So this is what she'll look like in the raw. I love the length, cut, texture, and density on Sienna. I love this wig. It's one of my favorite John Renault human hair wigs because it's great for everyday wear. It's long enough you can put it back in a ponytail pretty effortlessly, low buns even. I mean, you can do a lot with a wig this length and it's not so ultra luxe long that it's gonna be a complete pain to, to, you know, keep out of, you know, your seat belt or anything like that throughout the course of the day. Um, I, I really, really like this wig a lot. 
This is a 5.3 ounce wig, which is actually heavier than some of their longer wigs like the Angie. Part of the reason why is because you're getting quite a bit of hair. I mean, she's partially wefted. So the cap construction will also account for some of the added weight, you know, cause like Angie, for instance, is hand tied. So the cap construction definitely adds a little to the weight, but you're getting a lot of hair for a wig that's a mid length. And that gives you a lot of options about what to do with her. So I can't stop playing with it. I really like this one a lot. And I love the way this toffee truffle color looks in the human hair. It really does look like a beautiful ginger brown color. Nice medium ginger brown at that. So rich, delicious, looks great in the natural light as you can probably tell. It's just really pretty all the way around. Um, so this has been my review of the Sienna wig by John Renault in the color FS6-30-27. Again, the synthetic versions of this color do not look like this. This is much brighter, much redder, and a little lighter than the synthetic counterparts. I'm Heather from sisterwigs.com. That's C-Y-S-T-E-R-W-I-G-S.com, sisterwigs. And until next time, I hope you have a great afternoon. Bye-bye.